If not, it's still available on the iPlayer. <laughs> <laughs> Our project is the Love Where You Live Supporters Network. We believe that where we live matters. Cleaner streets, beaches and parks provide the backbone for stronger communities. For 60 years, 60 years next year, by the way, um, Kid Britain Times engaged people to actively care for the environment and their communities. We reckon at the rate of around a million hours volunteered per year through our charity alone. However, up till now, this strong giving current that we've got has had three key shortcomings, we think. One, it's only worked in parallel separated programmes. Two, it has never really recorded systematically the giving of time. And three, we never really gave back to our supporters anything else other than, well, a thank you note, really. With the help of the Cabinet Office and, and, and obviously of Nesta, we've put that right this year. We've developed a network that enables our supporters to find out about our programmes and campaigns and give time, money and skills to support them. To share that giving on an interactive map which brings our charity alive. To connect with each other and inspire one another to form groups and organise activities that increases giving and expands our supporter base. And we've also enabled our supporters to receive back the value of that giving as loyalty credits and turn that into savings by buying from our commercial partners. So where's the innovation? Well, until now, we think charity giving has been largely unilateral. People give us stuff, we say thank you. We think we've changed that a bit. People give us stuff, we measure that, we give them back credits, they can then change those into vouchers that will save the money with commercial partners who pay us for giving them the opportunity to work with a leading national charity. We've changed one giving vector into multiple giving vectors. We've made the giving multilateral. That giving is then amplified by our local and national profile, and we think now that our offering has never been more clear and the calls for action that we have never more loud. Now that, we think, calls for more giving. Half a million hours and two million credits on our system to kick off with. And we're encouraging, encouraging giving <laughs> to keep Britain tiny from both sides. Supporters on the one hand and companies on the other, which we think is actually quite interesting, innovative and encouraging for all concerned. Where do we go next? Well, like many of the people in this room, we've been on a bit of a journey. We're learning more and more how to innovate and do things differently. And that's largely thanks to our friends at the Cabinet Office and obviously Nesta, who you know, I'd like to say on behalf of everyone involved, in the charity angle of the programme, who have encouraged us and prodded us where necessary every step of the way. So big thanks to them. In time, our platform is going to engage tens of thousands of people and drive increased volunteering and funds into our charity, enable us to carry on, enabling us to carry on with engaging people and campaigning on the issues that matter for another 60 years and beyond. Thank you.